Hello, this is a new update, but it's only for the dual head printer owners because they need an extra spot channel for the white underbase. So let's go and see uh, one example. So we open uh, a document that we need. We resize and rename. We choose our halftone pattern. Okay, and after that we need to click the new button that says dual head white channel. So by clicking, by taking off first the background and by clicking this, you have your extra channel. So it's here, it's in the channels tab, there is a new white. Okay, so. Uh, every different software needs different name for this channel. Some of them need W1, some of them need to be called uh, white, or some of them need to be a fifth in a row. For example, cyan, magenta, yellow, black, white. Okay, four colors, one white. Uh, you can change the name from here if you need something else. Uh, but this is time consuming uh, to do it every time. So uh, I saved it as white now, but if you don't want this, you I will show you how to change it and saves you the right name every time. So let's delete it for now. Okay, and we go here, button mode, and you will see our folder with the action okay so we open this one and as you see there is one action in four steps okay the first step is to select the raster me file the layer okay now it's selected the second one is to convert it into cmyk color mode so here you see we already done that the third one, if you double click it, it's to select the transparency. Don't invert, you don't need it. So, okay. And now here, uh, it's creating the extra channel with the name uh, white and it's 100% every color. If you want to change the name into something else, you just double click this action okay and now you see our record button is activated here so you change anything you need to change in here or make this 100% white and this one let's call it now w1 okay capital or uh, small letters so here okay and now as you see the record button button is not active anymore and here it says w1 so it saves this for future use you don't have to do it again okay so if you go here if you click this one delete it okay go here deselect the raster me by just clicking it you will see we have again our um, file okay and if you go here you will see we have uh, our channel with name w1 now uh, some of these owners need another type of uh, they create a new document in a coral draw in or in another uh, any other let's say uh, program okay and they have this one. It's already with transparency or not, doesn't matter. Okay. And they want just this channel just for this. So what you do, you change this uh, now, image size and you make it uh, 30 maybe centimeters by 300 
dpi okay and you just click this button you you say okay because it cannot uh, find the raster me name here but if you click continued you will see that we have it but as you see we have another small problem now our um, channel okay like the image have a transparency pixels okay so you want to have a good result here you have to um, you have to half tone it or uh, import a document without transparencies and then do it this uh, action okay bye